Hey guys, welcome back to more FIFA 06 World Cup qualifying thing. Bonanza, yeah, the Bonanza's still there and it's going to be Luxembourg this time, guys. Away and yes, a very good couple of uh, results against Portugal in the uh, in the last couple of um, episodes, guys. It was just, yeah, it's been amazing. It's been really good. I Honestly, I, I've been sort of fearing it. I thought, you know what, we're probably going to lose to Portugal at least once. And uh, it turns out we haven't at all, guys. And it's just, that has been absolutely excellent. It's been, you know, I mean, the series is going a lot better than I thought it might be at this point, guys. So, really happy with it. But, uh, you know, I mean, we're making it count. With, you know, the, the really the only bad game we've had in qualifying, I would say, is probably just the Estonia one where we just, you know, we just really couldn't find anything at all. But other than that, they've got two Luwe Luwex in there. Yeah. And they've got a Rita. Whoa. But, um,. Yeah, it's been really good. This is the team that I've got. I've got Demo in there today, guys. I'm gonna put him back in there. Um, and yeah, I don't think I, I don't. I, I really, you know, my back four. I'm happy with the back four. I don't really need to change. It's just I'm really just changing the midfield every single game, guys. When I say I've said that in the last episode, and when I say that, that's all I'm doing. Even when I'm using subs later on in the match, I'm just using. Um, I'm just using like subs to uh, replace. Um, players in the midfield and that's it really that's really all I need to do in normal FIFA 06 that's the same thing I do anyway so um, yeah Luxembourg again guys come on let's do this this time again you know what I mean we, we beat them quite heavily last time didn't we I think oh what a turn that was come on now this is good oh keep it going ah oh, never mind um yeah so I, I'm I'm just I'm really happy with that you know what I mean I, I mean we could have won maybe I mean we maybe could have won the um, the last game guys you know when we played Portugal away but you know what I'm happy with the with a 1-1 you know what I mean that doesn't really bother me at all because you know we've just played so great that I'm just I'm not I'm not bothered about it it just it is really good you know what I mean when you you know when you're good to places like that and you're thinking you're gonna get beat but then you just perform well and it you know everything's just great in the end and uh, you know you get a lucky result against them and you, we, we got the better of Portugal you know what I mean we took four points off them so uh, you know the only really uh, the, on on paper the only really hard game left is uh, Russia now so if we uh, if we win that and again or even if we just get a draw you know it's fine it's cool and is this offside it is gonna be offside poo on you I think it was a bit of mint and it will be how far offside Oh, okay then, never mind. Um, yeah, so you know, Minty got a good, pretty good goal in the last one. You know, what I mean, our passing's been really good. You know, what I mean, we've been really good at finding space just lately um, on on the field in places. You know, what I mean, when when we're going forward, of course, uh, and whatnot, and we're using the wings really well. You know, what I mean, we are really using them very well. Okay, we didn't use it well there, but you know. Um, and other than that, you know, I mean, I think one of our problems against Portugal is just like stopping, like, you know, Portugal running down the wings, and that's way off target. Um, and I, I wish that we did that more, but you know what? In the end, it, you know, there was one or two mistakes, but it didn't cost us too much in the end. So we'll just we'll leave it at that and uh, move on with it. So Luxembourg, we still got to play Estonia again. So got to play Liechtenstein. And I think that's it, isn't it, guys? We still got to play them. We got to play Russia again as well, and and whatnot. So yeah. Oh, and I isn't there somebody else? No, I was going to say Romania, but that was a friendly game. Um. So uh, yeah. And I think something uh, interesting um, about because when we played Romania, I was expecting to see like Mutu in there, in the um. In like in like the Romanian squad, and apparently guys, because uh, so, uh, something I think it was something to do with him like taking drugs or something, um, and he like got sort of banned from FIFA games. Like if you play FIFA 06, it, 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 he's in the game playing for I think it's Juventus, uh, but he doesn't have his actual official name, which is uh, it's pretty strange. But yeah, that's just the way it is. And finish this one off, Minty. He will do nicely, nicely done, Minty. That's you know if I t if I turn there and tried to put it in the other corner I reckon um, I probably would have got stopped there I mean uh, just taking it a little bit forward and then just slots it into the bottom corner easily and that's a really good start in this one 
And, uh, you know what I mean? If we get another three points, we'll be well on our way. You know, I all I want to do is just just win. I, I think we pro I, I think because what are we on now? This 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 our seventh qualifying game now, I think, isn't it, guys? Or is it the eighth? No, I think it's the eighth, isn't it? Um, I would say we probably need to sort of like win maybe like three more games. We'd probably do. In fact, not even three. Maybe just like if we won this one in another two, that would probably just about do it. Uh, and then even if we just followed that up with a couple of draws or whatever, that I think it would just be fine. Um, but I really don't want to get second place. That's the thing. I really want to, you know, I really want to win the the whole thing. So, and uh, like I said, we've done we've done better than expected against Portugal. So, and I know I keep talking about it, but we oh, that's way off. But we really have, we've really have, I've surprised even myself with that one. And, uh, you know, I mean, we didn't have to change the formation or anything for it. We just sort of went for it and, no, got lucky enough. But uh, I am interested to see if there's any more um, friendly games coming up, which they should be. I mean, we've had, what, is it four? Have we had four friendly games now? Is it four? I think it's, yeah, I think it is four, isn't it? Um, so, you know, I'm probably expecting a couple more of those. And then I think... The qualifying will end in November, I want to say, should do, because um, we've got a couple, yeah, I think we've got like, this is our 8th qualifying game, so of 9th, 10th, 11th, 12th, so like, I think the next qualifying game should be like October time, uh, and then again in November, uh, but I'm, I, like I said, there should be like some more friendlies in the meantime. Um, and maybe another tournament, so we'll we'll see at the end of this game what's going on. But because uh, that, that's usually how it's done in real life. There's always like a couple of qualifying games together. You never see any more than that. But uh, you know what I mean, guys. I'm I, personally, you know, I'm not really a huge fan of international football, guys. You know what I mean? I really aren't that into it. You know what I mean? Um, I've never really have been. Oh, he should have finished that one. I thought. Um, Never really been that fan. I mean, when it's the World Cup or the Euro Euros, you know, I will watch them and whatnot. But other than that, at qualifying games, I'm really not a big fan of qualifying games. You know what I mean? I just, I, I just see it as the boring part of, of, you know, international competitions. You know what I mean? The, the, the main tournament itself is exciting, but like, you know, just just feels like it's a bit boring at times you know not the game not this game but I, like in real life i just always i never look forward to it it's like the fa cup i never look forward to the fa cup i just feel like it's so boring you know what i mean um but i, I don't get me wrong i mean i do like cup competitions when they get into the later stages and here's vitty oh never mind vitty um when they get into like the sort of semi-finals and the final you know, that's when that's when I start to get more interested in them, um, because I just I just hate having to go through all like the the quarterfinal stuff and and all that. It just uh, it just bores me. You know I mean, I'm I'm more of a league fan. You know, what I mean, I I like league games and watching league matches more than anything. And that's Rita. Way way way. It's Claude way. Let's, uh, you know what, let's see what we can do here. Because last time we took that free kick against Portugal and I held down the left bumper. Uh, not the left bumper, but left trigger when I was taking the shot. I was thinking it was going to do like a chip shot or something and it just didn't in the end. So, woo, what are we doing here? You know, let's just float it in. Okay, it needs to be more power on it than that, but whatever. Um... Yeah, that's what I did in that one. But, uh, yeah, when, when I when I say that, I you know, I like league games, you know, I do... I just do. I mean, I just find it more, much more interesting and entertaining. Just cup games, I just, I find them so dull. I mean, I just, I, half the time, I just don't care what's going on in them. But uh, yeah, especially, in, I'm not a fan of international. I'm not even a fan, a fan of friendly international games. Even if, like, I don't know, like in the past, like England have played the likes of Brazil and Spain and and all that kind of stuff. And you know, what I mean, some. A lot of people out there might find it interesting and and that, but for me, I just don't find the interest in it. I just, I just, I get bored of it. Oh, what a save! Holy hell, that is like the best save on this channel ever. <laughs> what a save that was! That was one of the best saves I've seen 
maybe, maybe of all time guys definitely in a while but uh, here's the second half that was just that should have been 2-0 and it wasn't unfortunately and here's a bit of Vitti who's going to bag it and there we go doesn't matter if we didn't score that one at the end of the first half there's the second and I'll tell you what we are we are starting to run away in this group nice little ball over the top takes it away from the defender there gets gets himself a little bit of space just finishes it up very nicely Boosh and in have a look at it again. Nice little touch. Takes it away. Rumpf. Kel. Bit of Kelage on that one. You know, I might even change some of the team around actually. Now that we're two up. Maybe. Maybe give it a while longer though yet. Um, here's Petrus. Into the box. Punched away. And. And. Mm, he had to do something there. Oh, taken away. The challenge was good. And they've got back on the ball again. And look at all this space here. That's a really good ball. And it's another one. That was so, so easy there. That just didn't require much thought at all. And they've scored. And that could just pull them away to make sure of the victory. 3-0, come on, we're after more in this one, if we can get like, I don't know, 6, 5, 6, that would be really nice. Is Minty, Minty's up for a hat-trick in this one, isn't he, I think? Nice little header, easily done. There was so much space there. It's kind of strange because the, like, the camera sort of zoomed out a little, which is strange. I wasn't really expecting it to do that uh, on this type of camera, but... Um, yeah. This is this is this is just sort of turned into a game now where I'm expecting more goals, goal after goal, please. So yeah, let's do it. Let's see if we can get that mint hat trick, guys. This could be it here if we play this right. Ah, oh, never mind. <laughs> we'll uh, we'll just lose the ball instead. Probably should have just crossed it in again, but whatever. Well, they've got a lot of space there on that right side, but they've gone left. Oh, oh, that was a pretty good little move there by Vitti. And he's in. Ah, he's going to lose it. Never mind. That doesn't matter. Let's just whip one in I suppose in fact you know what let's just let's not even bother whipping one in let's just pass it and then whip it <laughs> that's what she said it's all us oh man I tell you what I'm up for more goals in this one I'm feeling another goal I always say that why do I always say that <laughs> Oh, your mum with that pass. And here they are with possession now. No, come on, that's the wrong pass, man. Let's not get silly about this now. Let's just, you know, do the job. Oh, that's great. And he's going to screw it up in the end. You see, oh, the touching in this game is so bad. She said that too. But I ain't going to worry about it. Oh, and I thought that might have gone in there. And sometimes the goalkeepers do weird animations, but in the end, I guess it more time than not results in them just like winning the ball back. Yeah. And that's blocked out. And could be good. Ah, wasn't enough there. Defender was in the way of it. I'm feeling feeling a fourth goal though. Good challenge. Good work here. Ah, 
Our defence really hasn't had that much to do in this one, oh, this is good which is here. good. A passing game and a precise passage of play for them. Now oh, this is good. Comes back and into the box, and you know, just have a crack. <laughs> Why not? It was on target. From a very powerful shot. Oh, good save. Really good save there. I'll tell you what, their goalkeeper's been, do, been doing pretty good to stretch out to things in this um, in this match. Well, let's see if we can work something from the corner here. Oh, never mind, you know what, I was gonna I was gonna try and be clever, but you know what, being clever just never works for me. No, you know what? I, 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 I'm messing around now, guys. I apologise for that. I was just trying to be clever and obviously didn't work. A few subs, guys, are going to come on in a moment. And uh, that'll do. I think Nemeth's going to come on. And... I think the other one was... Oh, I don't remember his name now. Always happens. Always happens. Oh crap, well, that was nearly going to go in. Oh, come on, just don't... Whoa, what the hell was that? Carhan. Holy hell. That was some good... That was some good goodage, guys. Ah, oh, and you're going to screw it up in the end. Never mind. Oh, whatever. Um, Car yeah, Carhan's going to come off. And Link is going to come on. Nemeth's going to come on. And the last one... It escapes me, of course. Oh, come on, just run with it. Run, 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 run. And oh, I was going to pass to Vitti there, and it just didn't work. And it nearly went past the keeper, though. And that's the full time whistle. Yeah, you know what? When we was three 0 up, we just never looked in trouble. But we never really looked in trouble when we went two 0 up either. So I'm down with that today. Let's see what the stats have to say. How many uh, how many shots did we have this time? Uh, we had ten shots, nine on target. So he's really good with accuracy today, guys. Not bad. But uh, we're getting closer and closer to uh, to qualifying now. Uh, five points clear of Portugal, so on the same amount of games. Russia do have a game in hand, but even if they win it, they'll still be behind Portugal. Uh, are in fed place because of the goal difference on 15 so that's looking good Estonia have played 9 there and uh, what's going on in the other groups it doesn't well Switzerland are running away with it there in fact even France are still in trouble because Israel is still behind them uh, Norway Slovenia Italy only played 6 England Port Poland that really never changes San Marino I still can't believe that <laughs> Croatia on 16 Czech Republic. I think we've got the highest amount of points out of anyone now. Denmark are on 16, Greece are on 15, we're on 20. Doing better than anyone. But anyway, guys, uh, here is another uh, tournament. And I did say, you know, there is a chance that we might get put into a tournament. And look at that. We're going to be against Japan, Mexico, and the almighty Brazil. Holy hell, guys. In the other group, it's going to be Germany, Australia, Argentina, and Cameroon. So this is a very interesting tournament. This is gonna, this is gonna make this game even more interesting now, isn't it? So, yeah, guys, we'll guess we'll see what happens. And it is gonna be the Almighty Brazil first, guys. We're on the 16th of June now. So three big games in the in the tournament. Let's see if we can do better this time. I tell you what. Even if we don't beat Brazil, I reckon if we if we won against Japan and Mexico, that might just be enough. But we'll you know. We're still going to go for the win, guys. So very interesting stuff coming up for the uh, the next episode, guys. We're going to be against Brazil. Let's see how this one goes then. What are we going to play for this match? I couldn't even tell you that. I don't know. Probably just the same thing anyway, but yeah. Comment, subscribe, and share as always. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time for Brazil.